Hey, how's it going today, everybody? It's Robin here with Aries Fire Tarot. Uh, I'm just going to do another segment of um, angels for you guys. The last one I did was the angel and gemstone connection. If you haven't seen that, just look in the folder, um, uh, The Universe Speaks. I've got a bunch of different videos on angels. So I've done some research on the different kinds of angels. There's actually 11 different kinds. So let me know in the comments if you a knew about that and b and let me know if i'm forgetting any at the end so um the first angel that i discovered was abundance angels so a lot of us are i don't want to be like say obsessed but we're concerned with our financial state of affairs right you know uh times can be pretty tough for people out there all you have to do is look at the news so there are actually angels assigned to answering prayers for abundance. So if you're having a tough time, shout out to an abundance, abundance angel for some help. In the same vein, there are also, um, oh, sorry about that. I had to cough. So there are healing angel, angels. So if you feel like you're in need of healing, and that does, doesn't mean physical healing, right? It could be emotional healing, whatever you need healed you could pray to a healing angel and you could just say, you know, Hey, healing angels, I need help. Please work with me, whatever. Um, the next set of angels are the angels of mercy. And these are the angels that they, um, they particularly help in prisons and war zones, um, hospitals. They are, available in times of crisis so like car accidents and like the titanic and stuff like that they answer the call for mercy so that's pretty cool i think that that would be a great job actually i think i'll do that uh in my next life messenger angels they work between dimensions they deliver inspiration to the masses and individuals they connect our prayers to the right angel and direct universal flow, which is fascinating to me. Um, so if you were praying for abundance, then one of these messenger angels would take your prayer and take it to an abundance angel. So that's pretty cool. So we have power angels. They empower us to be brave and to step into our power. So this is like if you're feeling afraid, right? Um, sometimes you're scared to go do something, then you could just pray to a power angel for the strength to do that. And they'll give you that little bit of a boost that you need to accomplish, um, that task. Star angels, they help our wishes come true, manifesting. Um, they connect us to the right people and opportunities, which is pretty nice. Like you hear so many stories of people just bumping into that right person that could help them out. Um, and that's, that's what the star angel does. It, if you're praying to have your wish come true, then the, the star angel would work behind the scenes to help you run into the right people to make that wish come true. Peace angels, they help us through challenges and they will walk difficult journeys with us. I love that. They will walk difficult journeys with us. So if you're having a really tough time, you guys, um, you know, there's people just go through so much on this earth. You know, you're not alone. You can, you can talk to any one of these angels, you guys, or an archangel. Um, I've got flower angels next. So I didn't even know about flower angels until I did this research, you guys. So they answer prayers concerning conservation and protection of nature they help to heal the planet and connect us to beauty i love that very amazing um helper angels there are angels for hire <laughs> for the price of a prayer these angels will step in to help with a quick project or inspiration who knew you know <laughs> we got temp angels um, then there are archangels who are overseers of all other angels. They're very powerful and each one has a specialty. I think I'll do my next video on archangels unless you guys have another um, idea. And then there's guardian angels. They are assigned to you at birth. So every one of us have, has at least one angel. They know you the best and love to help you with your deepest wishes. So... 
I mean, it's kind of, you know, on one hand, a little bit calming and assuring, reassuring that we all have an angel. But, you know, it's kind of also strange that you have an angel hanging around all the time. It's like, you know, can I have a minute? You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I think that angels are so beautiful, you guys. If you like, I just love to watch that movie City of Angels because it just it fills me with so much love that knowing that there's all these angels out there and it, I don't know, it's just so beautiful to me. So let me know you guys your angel experiences down below in the comments. Let me know if you've ever heard of some of these angels before or if there's angels um, that I haven't heard of before because I love just discovering more about angels. As you know, I've, I've been doing a segment once a week for quite some time now because angels just, um, they mean so much to me. So, and I know that they mean a lot to um, many of the viewers out there. So anyway, you guys, that's all I had on this segment uh, for angels. So um, I'm gonna wrap it up and thanks so much for paying attention and tuning in and subscribing and just being here. Love you guys a lot. Bye for now, bye.